Hi people, it's Ellie here and I have my tea, so you know what that means, it's another episode of Tea Time! I am so excited because this is going to be a reaction video to the new Mockingjay teaser trailer and I am so excited for this movie. I am in love with the Hunger Games trilogy. It's my favorite thing ever and the first two movies were amazing. So I am so excited to see this. So let's get started. Here we go. Oh. Are you kidding me? That's it. That's all we get. Oh my god. This was way too short. Oh my god. Uh, so... The teaser trailer, if you haven't seen it, there'll be a link in the down bar, but it it was good. It was just way too short. Oh my gosh. Basically, one of the first things you see is a hovercraft, and it looks very nice, by the way. And the music is very, like, -na 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 -na, kind of, like, depressing, and you're like, oh, this, this is fascinating. I want to see more. But the whole trailer is just, like, they show nothing. They show in total about three scenes, but it draws you in so much, and I cannot wait. I cannot wait. I cannot wait. If you haven't read the Hunger Games books yet, um, just a little background on the Mockingjay movie without giving any spoilers. Um, if you couldn't tell from the Catching Fire, the games are over. There's no games in this last movie, and it's pretty much just war and mayhem and a free-for-all killing spree, and this trailer, I don't think, displayed it that well. Obviously, they did show the war aspect and how grave everything is and how, and how everything is just strict, and you do see, like, a gunshot, but I feel like this teaser is making the movie out to seem lighter than it actually will. Even though they're trying to make it seem harsher, it seems very light. Like, Plutarch is trying to convince Coin that they can't kill Katniss, and you see all this people, like, going to war, and kind of, and then you see this huge room of people and Katniss walking through the people with her arrows, and it's supposed to be all very dramatic, but I don't think they did a very good job of making it as dramatic and as intense as it should have been. If I'm gonna be honest, this isn't my favorite teaser trailer for this movie so far. My favorite one was, I think it was the first one. Everything is white and you just see snow and the camera slowly moves and you can kind of see there's people next to him and then it keeps moving and keeps moving and then you're like, okay, this is kind of boring and all of a sudden, BAM! You see PETA and then I just like, bah! oh my god! And it was the best thing and I wish I got a reaction for it, I really do. But it was the so good and I probably watched it a hundred times on repeat. I was just like, this was so good. I'm so glad they did this. Uh, but this teaser trailer, I, it didn't, I wasn't, it was like, in the moment it was like, oh my god, oh my god. But it was so short and I felt like it didn't represent the book that well, even if, I did watch it a second time off camera. There were a couple fighting scenes, and but it seemed like the full thing was just um, Plutarch and Coin, and then it was Katniss and the group of people, and then there was a bit of snow saying that Mockingjay is a bad symbol and anyone who has it will die. Um, and you see a bit of a little snippets of war, but it's not the best representation of the book, and it's. As I've said it already, it seems like they're trying to be more dramatic and shocking than it actually is. Well, it is very shocking, but they're not doing a very good job at making it shocking and dramatic. And they want to have a very somber feel and just drag you in and just be like, this is going to be an amazing movie. And I wasn't feeling that from this teaser trailer. Slightly disappointed, but 
I'm still glad that we get to see some in the movie for the first time. I still have very high hopes for this movie, and I hope all you guys do too, because this trilogy is just amazing, and the first two movies were so amazing, so very high hopes for this next movie. Anyway, that's it, so I hope you liked it. If you did, please make sure to give a big thumbs up, and I will see you next time. Bye!